Hello! Today I'm going to show you um, how to change out your standard two-prong outlet with these really cool new Leviton tamper-resistant um, USB chargers. So you can have two things plugged in plus two USB devices charging and there's really nothing to it. It's really just a substitution. You don't have to know how to do any electrical work, really. Um, the first thing I did was I turned off the power to my outlet down here. Um, and you always want to use one of these checker, charger, charger checkers to make sure that the lights are, uh, I mean, the electric is really off. And always check both outlets. Um, it, will, it would glow orange if it was on. Um, but check both, because sometimes they're wired on separate circuits, and you can think the top one's off and the bottom one isn't. So we're going to, um, the only thing you're going to need for this project is a new outlet. They're about $25. I got mine at Home Depot for this brand, but they sell other brands other places. And you need a new um, cover, which are like 65 cents, because that old cover won't work anymore. So the first thing we're going to do is remove the plate, which is pretty easy. And I tiled this backsplash, so when I take this off, this might not look like your standard box. This is an outlet extender to make the outlet stick out farther into the tile. Um, yours might just be a regular box. And then because mine's on an outlet extender, it has really long screws to hold the outlets in. Yours might only have standard screws. So I'm going to take them out. Like I said, mine are really long. It takes forever. Can you still see this? Good. Okay. So this is my outlet. And this is the outlet extender. And the actual box isn't back in there. So if you're doing it in, on, in drywall, for example, you'll be, all your work will be in the box. So <clears throat> you're going to pull it out. Try not to pull it too hard, but it's gonna, you're going to need to pull pretty firmly. So you have two live wires. They're black and white. And then you have a ground wire that's copper. And this is a quick connect. This is a quick connect outlet. So they're just stuck in the back <clears throat> without being wound around a screw. Older outlets will have screws on the side, you don't have to unscrew them, but these quick connects, you just put your screwdriver in the slot and the wires pop out, but they just pop right out. And the ground is going to be traditional, a traditional silver, or silver screw or a green screw. So come here, you. There you go. So there you go. Goodbye. Now, these outlets have two options. You can either wind the wires all the way around the screws and tighten them down, or they have this really cool feature where it's like a quick, it's like an alternative quick connect. You can just stick the wires, you can just stick the wires in the outlets and screw it down. And I don't know if you can see it, but in really tiny words it says white and hot. So you want to make sure you put the white one in the white side and the hot one in the hot side. And so I'll, I'll do it that way. So you put them, there's a little like flange that'll connect your, I'm trying to get out of the way still. And you want to connect it really hard. I mean, not crack the plastic hard, but pretty darn hard. And then just like on the other one, the ground will go around the green screw. Okay, so then, so you have the, oop, you have the, everything screwed in and you put it back in the wall and it's going to be pretty tight. There we go. And I have to take off these short ones that come with the thing because, like I said, mine's on the really long outlet extender. And it's right in there. Put these back on. Okay. Screw them back in. And then put the plate on. So you do the other one too, but this is not that exciting to watch, so I'm going to show you that part. And then these plates will go on those extra little screw holes. And ta-da! You now have beautiful USB things. 